Hello and welcome back to Coton Gaming. We are here in Europa Universalis 4 playing as Aragon trying to get all of the Jeeves. Well at least all the ones that I can possibly get. Uh, we will check if last episode we did get the um, three rival nations. We did networking. We have a 100, 100 point spy network in three rival nations. We have got it. Good. That's the way I can check if we got the achievements rather than the pop-up which apparently is disabled while recording. Um, there's a lot of achievements we can get, but we've got one already, which is good. Let's tick that one off. We are sort of dealing with some rebel problems in our vassals or our personal union's territory, which is terrible. We've got some Moroccan separatists as well as some noble rebels in um, in Naples. Uh, Venice has already increased. Uh, two points thanks to the the, um, the colonists we've got in Valencia which is brilliant can I do it in my subjects I can't do it in my subjects land okay that might be a bit too OP but I feel like I would want to do that anyway so hopefully they change that or at least hopefully they see if it will be a bit too OP we are trying desperately to get the seventh um, level of technology for diplomacy uh, and the end of this year, we'll be able to get 150 points. In, in Cal Cagliari. So it is copper. I will have the production, please. There's no production. Uh, trade them. Which is brilliant. We've got tech, that is the military tech. We will take that. We can now have cannons. I probably will get at least one cannon if I can. I can now. Because uh, we got... Oh, we, we increased the, the force limit because of our vassal. I don't think personal unions count to increase your force limit. No, they do not. So personal unions, bad on force limit. Vassals, good. Uh, we'll get the we'll get two. We'll get two cannons there, and we will obviously get another cavalry unit here, trying to get up to four. All of that has ended, which is good. Bring our units back. We've got a thousand ducats. My God. Uh, we haven't got high income there. Buildings. We'll build some more buildings. If I can find the bloody thing. Uh, we'll do it to 12. Nutrio Porto. Yep. Porto is a estuary. The Duro estuary. We'll get that. And for the time being, we'll actually just drill, I think. We will see what we can do here if we get any more. Right, so when does that end? We can actually remove... Yeah, actually, we're going to pop them up to 100 so we can get 200 Diplo power. And then we'll remove one of their... Uh, wrong thing. One of their provinces. Which I probably... That one's got a natural harbour, that one's got a natural harbour. That one has actually got a uh, entry pot. Entry pot. We will remove it from here. That will increase it by plus five unrest. Which would be bad, but it means they're, they won't be at 100% so the uh, disaster won't spawn. Um, we will just sink our... Our prestige into these to get the military power and so the mission to the Pope. Why not to get those? So we've got well, that's boosted. We can already apparently not. Oh, because we've got a um, minus ten percent diplo tech cost. So there we go. Now we have colonial range, and we will actually Arctic South American Sea try and get that 
going? And of course, Secretus of Malta. Okay. Losing money. How are we losing money? Has our trade just drastically gone down? We are reinforcing. That's fine, we're reinforcing the army. That's what it is, and we've just built some uh, cannons. So we we'll explore the coast down there so we can get. We've already discovered a piece of North or South America. I think, um, uh, argument, the Bay of Argument, the uh, Cape Verde does count. Also, I didn't set that as my required pieces of land. In three more years, I will de uh, declare war on Portugal again, get some of their land. Just do the seas now and then we'll do the coasts. It's slowly getting better. My treasure to run power of the nobility, oh well. Burgers are down now, so we will actually uh, give the land back. They're still pissed at us. Hopefully they should be increasing current changes 0.12. It's not that good. Yeah, we'll just do the seas to get that out of the way so we can actually see first. Whoa! That is bold. That is incredibly bold. Morocco just took Lisbon. I've never seen Morocco do that before. Holy crap. Should we get that? Right, stop doing that. Yeah. Sure. Where can we actually, can we get there now? Too far. Shit. Bollocks. <laughs> back, back to Venice. Not Valencia. Fle Fle Valencia, not Venice. Jesus Christ. Were they not? Were these not permanent claims? Oh, no, just game claim. Okay, they went permanent. That's uh, unusual. But holy shit! Now they're allied with Tlemcen, which is fine by us. We just won't call their ally in. Holy crap. Yeah, they're allied with Brittany, which is fine by me. I mean, that is bold. That is extremely bold. So yeah, our truce with uh, Portugal is up, is it up? No, we've got until August. Now with Brittany, so hopefully we can use France's military access and it won't count as me uh, black f uh, flagging ourselves. Military former. Look at the negatives are neg oh, bad. Now, what we want to do is take all but like one province. <laughs> That's a full core. That's a full uh, thing here. Yeah, what we want to do 
is like take the mainland and the Azores. We'll, we'll leave them with um, with Arguin. I think. And then when we declare war, um, actually, we can vassalize them. Yeah, we'll leave them with Argon. We'll vassalize them, but leave them with Argon. And then we'll declare war on Morocco, get them to uh, give uh, Lisbon back, because it'll be a call to reconquest Lisbon. Uh, we'll take Madeira as well in that war. Give them Lisbon back, but then take Argon. Uh, as in, like, uh, take their land from them. Because we can do it with the vassals. Uh, it is... Seize land. They'll be pissed with us for a bit, but they'll have Lisbon back and they can still trade. They can still colonize from Lisbon. They should be able to. They've got expansion ideas as well. They're going heavy on this. Just to get that, that second colonist, I guess. Not bad, not bad. But yeah, that, that's what we're going to do. And we're going to... Brittany will not accept. Okay. Yeah. France will come in, but I don't really want them to. They've got 1,000 units. Okay. So, fort defense, why not? Yeah, so we can... Walk to there. Coasts. So we will take those two lands. Uh, we can't take that apparently. We can take those. Okay, it looks like they're having um, having the Azores then. As soon as we apparently can't core it. Actually, no, we will be able to. We just need to get there. Which, in that case, we will take our troops and just land them there. They are black flagged there, so we can't kill them no matter what. <laughs> we are landing on... Well, their siege went straight away. Go back into our own lands. Right, we do want to give this all to uh, Castile. So Castile can do that. We'll give these two to Castile as well. We're just sort of powering through here. This is good. Give them that. Do we want them to have... That's three. That's six. That's fish, and that's fish. Yeah, we'll leave them with Argon. Uh, but we ourselves will take uh, Cape Verde. Because, yeah, so they'll leave with that. We don't want them to, we will actually get them to cancel their call on Sieta. We don't want them to have that. We will vassalize them. Portugal will hate us still. What has changed? Everything has already gone well. Now, the reason why we took um, Cape Verde for ourselves was purely to get colonial, colonial range. We can now go a lot further than what we could have because we were stuck here. When is our truce with... Uh, one more year. Brilliant. Do we want to make it a core? <sighs> Not particularly, no. Can we put it in part again? Oh, I should have waited a month. Nope, does it anyway. Okay. Uh, we'll do that. Oh, no. no wait, if, add it, wait a month, then increase it to me. That's what it is. Sure. We'll core it, we'll core it anyway. We will start drilling again. We'll move them into there. 
which you can drill there. So it's a bit closer. So yeah, they are just a one province. Mine are now Portugal. How embarrassing for them. And we've got West African Charter, which is good. We will pay off the debts, just. Uh, place relative on the throne. They apparently will not. They have an outraged attitude with us. And that's fine by me. We'll give them Lisbon back. That should be good. We need to make, keep making sure that uh, Aragon has 36. We can give them four more. That's one there. Three more on top of that. Hmm, maybe we should don't give them anything. Well, three more would be the Garberry, wouldn't it? Yeah. So is it less than... It's less than, so they have to own 39. <laughs> Never mind then. <clears throat> okay, we lost the claim on Tunis, which is fine with me because they're allied with the Ottomans anyway. And the Tlemcen War, we will get them to uh, get rid of their Ottoman uh, alliance. Basically, anything to get the Ottoman or let make the Ottomans a bit weaker. I think we need to core it to get the extra range from uh, Cape Verde, I think. There we go, there's the Moroccan. Moroccan truce up. We should be able to take them out easily. We're at tech 7 now, we're at tech 6. We'll just wait until the next month so our units will be uh, be at full maintenance. Cancel that next month. Glory Road, one base in Kirkane. Okay. Okay. Random. Random gain of a uh, of a development point. Drill off and then will aid us. No, he won't. We will reconquest Lisboa. Just because we get a take less aggressive expansion, a lot less, 75% less, and 25% less uh, cost. So we'll do that. We'll ask someone to go and get it. Shock sure, Castile. Uh, therefore it's fully maintained. And we'll go and try and sort of carpet siege these guys down. Yeah, I'm not busted, okay. Losing and gaining here and that. Great warriors do not read books. Quite frankly, they do, but sure. We're close to getting another governmental reform, which gives three options this time. This seems a bit weird. So we've got plus 25% income from vassals and nobility plus 5. We've got nobility minus 10 and national time plus 10. And we've got monthly autonomy change minus 0.05. I think it's just good on multiple levels. We'll raise war taxes just to uh, get a little bit more money each month. Exploring provinces everywhere we go. They're trying to siege us down while we're trying to siege them down. Has Tillemson got another fort? They have. Jump explorer, gutted. Uh, we'll, no, no, not remain. We'll come back from Desmond. We didn't marry him actually. We should be able to marry Portugal now, though. If we have a free person, we gained a consort, which I'm hoping was just. 
Where is it? There it is. Yep. <laughs> We're going to consult of our own dynasty. Yeah, you have to core it. So now I'm just going to wait. Because there's a jail fee of seven. Do you know? We'll come into this. We'll aid them. Hopefully we can get there in time. We did. They're capturing ships left, right, and center. Or at least the uh, Portuguese did. Did they not? No. Okay. Confused about that. The colonial range again. Get that up. We now have colonial range. That is incredible. Keep having people that do that. So we'll come back just to get a general. Goodness, general from my thought. Um, we'll go Caribbean. Try and get the Caribbean. Or at least discover the Caribbean first. There we go, that siege is done. Yeah, they will stay until they're repaired. Which is fine by me. Hello. Will you take a uh, Ottoman? No. Did you an ally in the war? How about if I uh, siege you down a bit? Will uh, who you want out now? You will. Pleasure doing business with you. I will take war reps, will you? Sure. I'll take that. Get rid of your Ottoman ally. And give me your money. And then we'll probably... Go in and... Go and take this guy out. Now we are going to win this anyway, so we'll go back. Good, we'll go back. So we get locked, and we'll go into garb again. We've got Joe Luckers in as a fast. Uh, as, as a uh, co-belligerent, not co-belligerent, non-co-belligerent, non-co-belligerent is the right thing. We're sieging Lisboa down. So what we want them to do is we want them to return Lisboa to Portugal. We want to take Madeira, well, give Madeira to um, Castile. We want them to revoke their cause under Algrave and Miller. And maybe just all your money? There's a lot of money. You, you were making a lot of money. Holy crap. And I also want them to steal for that. So, has that got a castle? Has. Uh, Portugal can pay for that. It's their bloody land anyway. Look at that siege, come on. Bloody Naples being stupid again. Jesus, come on. It's 42%, it's going to stay on 42%. Once I break the wall down, it's fine by me. Let's go. 
be attacking into the mountains, never a good thing. But I feel like massive numbers advantage. Should the Shadow Kingdom has fired? Great. So if we look at uh, the Holy Roman Empire, it's just Luca. But Luca will eventually um, get out of the empire anyway. So I've, I've seen um, the the free cities will stay in the empire past the event, but then a couple months or like a year later, they'll just leave anyway. I think it's to try and stop this from happening, that they automatically leave. Well, they just decide to, who knows? Uh, but we will see the effects of that in the next episode. So thank you for watching to the end. If you have done so and you like the episode, make sure you uh, click that like button and subscribe. It is always appreciated. But until next time, goodbye.